with every major android update phones tend to get slower and lag a little bit at least initially so in this video i'll try and show you some settings and things you could do to make your phone feel faster on your samsung one ui4 running on the android 12 so guys don't forget to like this video also subscribe to the channel let's begin whenever you install a major android update it's a good thing that you wipe the cache partition so to do this first power off your phone you need to connect your phone to a computer or a laptop so that you can get into recovery mode now hold down the power button and the volume up button and uh, you should get into the recovery mode in a few seconds as you can see over here so once you see this screen use the volume down button to navigate to the wipe cache partition and press the power button once now if you have any performance issues or any battery drain issues this may actually solve it so anyway it's a good thing to wipe your cache partition now select yes and press the power button and this should clear the cache partition in just about a few seconds as you can see here so now you need to restart the device and also give it some time to sort of reboot and load all the apps and also maybe restart it one more time and see if that makes any difference so the next thing is to go into the settings and accessibility visibility enhancements and here you need to reduce the transparency and just enable that so what it basically does is it kind of uh, disables this sort of beautiful blur effect but if you want performance and if it is lagging in your phone particularly probably the Exynos phones or older phones then you can disable this and this can make difference now the next setting you can do is go into the device and battery care and again click on the battery option here and go all the way down and here you will find more battery settings now try and disable the adaptive battery because this may cause some issues on some phones so try and experiment and see turn it off and maybe turn it on later and see the difference but also more importantly enable the enhanced processing this will basically does not limit the processor so basically the processor works at its best so the next setting that you can do is go into the display and here you can do a couple of things uh, firstly enable the touch sensitivity this should improve the touch sensitivity because if the touch sensitivity is less it may also feel slower so it helps with that also go into the navigation bar and if you really feel the animations are not good then you can always enable the buttons and believe me guys that this actually works really really well and feels quite fast but you have to sort of sacrifice the gestures but performance is gonna be pretty good now the next thing that you can do is go into the settings all the way down to about phone and just click on the software information and just rapidly click on this and you should enable the developer options mine is already enabled so you will find these at the bottom of the settings page so here go into the animations and here normally it is advised that you should use the 0.5x now yes it does make the phone look faster but not necessarily smoother so i personally chose to keep it at actually 1.5x uh, at least on this one i feel this makes it look smoother the animations feel a bit relaxed and smoother otherwise you can also use the 0.5x or 1x as per your liking so next up just search for the samsung pay and go into the settings and here quick access disable quick access for samsung pay on pretty much everywhere except maybe lock screen because as it doesn't need to trigger the samsung pay particularly when using the multitasking tray it can make it a bit more responsive another little thing that you can do is go into the wallpapers and uh, lock screen enhancements disable the dynamic lock screen because it is just another process running in the background so just disable that also on the same home settings page you can disable the samsung free as well so that's been it for this quick video guys if you found it helpful like this video subscribe thanks for watching i'll see you soon